Oh my gosh. Hi, it's Casey and welcome to my channel. And I have just been talking to a camera that apparently has not been on. And I don't know how your cameras work on your phone, but if you leave it on for, I don't know, maybe three minutes, it will shut itself off automatically. And I would have never known if it hadn't shut itself off automatically that it wasn't going. And I was being hilarious and excited and it was the best video I've ever shot. So we're gonna back up. Um, I actually have not opened the box yet, which is crazy. I'm so glad that I haven't opened the box because this, was the box it was in this and it was do you see how much duct tape is all around it so much duct tape anyway um let's pretend we're at the beginning i got friend mail and it's friend mail from amber meeks you might know her from ambazar's diy and other things and i did know that i was getting this friend mail because she told me and a few other people that are getting it, actually quite a few other people, um, that she wanted to do this for us and she didn't want us to watch anybody else's unboxing video if they were posted, which is why she wanted to tell us. And she had told me that she actually was hoping to send mine out first because she knows that I'm a peeker and I probably would, would watch other people's videos and she didn't want that. Um, but I have not seen any yet when I am post or when I am shooting this. So this is gonna be totally a surprise. I, it took me a while to get into all that packaging and I was even telling you how it's been hard because like if, if it, if I would have, if the other people had gotten theirs first and I would not have had mine, I probably would have ended up watching some videos because I like to know the endings of movies and TV shows that I watch. I will skip in a book I'm reading and read like, you know, the last chapter or um, last few pages. I would open up Christmas presents. And I am doing all of that, telling you this while I'm opening it. And now I feel like it just looks like I've probably looked in it because my box, I had seriously just gotten to the point where I was opening it when it went off. Not that you guys care, but I care. So I'm sharing back to the package. I'm sure I'm forgetting to tell you something really important. So just pretend I have Packing papers. Oh, look. Oh, look. Okay. It's a, like a cute basket. Ooh, I think I'm losing things out of the cute basket. <laughs> it's a Valentine's basket. How sweet. And there are, there's some things in the, the, um, the box. She wrapped it up really good. Um, how sweet is this? It says happy Valentine's day and there's a lollipop. I'm going to look at the stuff that's kind of falling out. There's some twilight body fantasies mist. Um, this actually looks cute. I'm going to save that because I see a, um, a note card and there is a little business card. This is from sugar and rose body butter shopify.com. Okay. Let me read my card. Okay, here's what she wrote. Casey, I'm so happy that we came across each other on YouTube. I love how brutally honest you are on your channel and how talented you are with makeup and educating us on skincare. You make me laugh with some of your comments and stories. It is so fun to have so many virtual friends. And yes, you can call us all friends, even though we have not met in person. Um, I was talking about that one time. A, I hope you enjoy the little basket of goodies that I put together for you. I threw a little something in there for Nadia since she's becoming a regular on your channel. You two are so cute and fun to watch. Love your crazy friend, Amber. That is so sweet, Amber. Um, um, yeah, Amber is... I've never met her. I don't know what she's like to live with or anything, but <laughs> she just seems so kind and sweet and nice and funny and outgoing and motivated and so much energy and some of the things that she'll be posting and doing I'm laying in bed and watching her I'm kind of exhausted thinking how is she getting that stuff done um I feel like again every, I 
always feel silly trying to tell on my YouTube channel about another YouTuber who I'm sure everyone knows already. And if you have any idea who that you're watching my channel of stuff, then I would think that you would know her. So, yeah. Um, I don't even know where to begin on opening this cute little package. Um, so, and if Nadia's gift doesn't have her name on it specifically, you should make sure I know which thing it is so that, you know, I don't use it. Um, I bet she made this cute little bow, which is so cute. Oh, this says Nadia. Nadia be my Valentine. And it has a little bag of stuff on there. How sweet. Um, Nadia actually is not here right now. Um, so she's going to have a surprise when she comes home. How cute. Um, which, so I'm going to guess this bag is for me. Um, this also is Revive, what is this? Balance and Nourish Paraben Sulfate Natural Cleansing Sponges. Um, so this might be similar. Um, do I have a weird sparkle? Um, I had a clay, pink clay infused sponge that came in, I think my first cause box and it's really nice. Um, it really, when I was trying out that black soap bar from Erno Laszlo that I really don't care for and it would leave my skin feeling so dry after using it. The only thing that helped while I was in the shower I would use like that pink clay infused sponge over my face and it felt like it hydrated it back up a little bit. So I'm going to say that I think that this is probably someone and that I will like this. This is some white cheddar and are they both and maybe just regular flavor of skinny pop popcorn. Um, I don't know that you actually care, but my husband and I really don't celebrate Valentine's Day or like we'll go out to eat sometimes or something like that, but we don't really buy each other gifts. I don't know that I've ever gotten actually a Valentine's gift like this. Um, he has like one time and this may have been still when we were dating and he was a telephone service man doing like repairs. Um, and on Valentine's Day, a floral shop, you know, landline telephone went out and he came in to fix it. And like, they were so happy with how quick he did it or something that they gave him like a flower. Um, and he gave that to me. I really, that's the only time that I can remember getting a Valentine's gift from him. Um, this is fun. I like getting presents. Um, this is a cute little bag, heart bag, with stuff coming out of it. This says Luna Ice. Oh, you know what? I bet because this is candy that it has. Um, how cute. Oh my gosh. How cute. That is so funny. This says YouTube star. <laughs> um, that's hilarious. Um, it says, I'm kind of a big deal on YouTube. Um, and then it has my channel name up there. Christine has opinions and terrible video skills. Um, I did change it to Casey. I, I think about going back sometimes to Christina. It just, I hated that it looked so long on everything. That, and nobody then, if, you know, if somebody would mention my channel, they would just say Casey. And then I felt like nobody would probably know who Casey was because my name said Christine on it. It was a whole long mess. Anyway, so I changed it. I might, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Um, but I love... This, I love that it has my real name on it, and that's hilarious, because clearly, you know, I'm not a big deal, but I do like being sarcastic, so um, that it says there, that on it, that's hilarious. I love it. I can't wait for my husband to come home and that I'm drinking out of this cup, and he'll have no idea where I got it. That will be funny. <laughs> um, what else is in there? So much candy. Hershey Kisses and jelly gummies, yummy, and jelly beans um, in nice normal flavors, not like some crazy, what, what are those things called? The weird ones where you do yucky tasting things. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff in here. What's this? This must be from that Sugar and Rose company. Ooh, cinnamon snickerdoodle. The writing is very tiny on this. It smells 
cinnamon snickerdoodle. Um, I don't know if it's, I think it's a lotion, maybe a shimmery lotion. I was afraid that like it would come out too dark or something, but it's not, it's blending right in there. It's just a little shimmer. With my shoulders showing, I should be doing it there. Ooh, look, I'll be sexying up. Woo! My husband will come home from work today. Maybe I'll need to... Have us go out. To where? I don't know, because we can't go anywhere. But it'll feel like we should be going out. <laughs> Ooh, look at me looking good. Probably need to hit my collarbone, too. Ooh, and I smell delicious. I feel like it's, there's a better name than cinnamon snickerdoodle though, snickerdoodle. Because it's more like the cinnamon, the cinnamon gummy bears. With some cinnamon toast crunch. <laughs> um, cause cinnamon snickerdoodle makes me think that it would smell a lot sweeter, and this smells more. I mean, it's still sweet, but it's like the um, yeah, you know the the gummy bears that are cinnamon. I think that. I think that. Yes, yes, I do. Okay. You're going to have to work for this one. Laugh out loud. It won't take long and it's super cute. I don't know what this means. Does this mean I should open it? Maybe I'll show the rest and so I can put this down. Um, oh, this is so cute. And so, ah, this is so cute. Um, it says celebrating ladies. Um, and I know you get tired of everything. I repeat myself so often, but, um, we've moved into this really tiny apartment where I really, I don't feel like I can do much decorating, you know, in an apartment that I only planned to be here for like three months when we first moved in. But of course that turned into, it'll be a year in March. Um, but I like to decorate for holidays, but then it's too little to really do it. But changing out my, um, kitchen towels is one of the things that I think is easy and cute and I like to do. Um, and so these will be so cute. And they're the one that goes over my stove, um, handle is the one that we don't actually use. <laughs> it's just there for pretty, um, and to be decorative. And I love it. Thank you. And I've never seen these anywhere, or I probably would have picked them up for my own self. Um, and how cute, how cute, how cute. Okay. Um, I'm going to see what's in here too. My gosh. Um, this is the longest video ever for, um, gifts for me that, um, <laughs> what does this one say? This It's cute. I love these little papers that she stuck onto things. Okay. Um, this little lipstick is a pin. The top just pops off. I kept trying to unscrew it. And the one I kept for myself got messed up. Laugh out loud. Okay. So Now she has me worried that I'm going to like break it. I'm going to work on this or usually I'm bad, but things like this, I'll hand to my husband and say, here, open this for me because I'm too dumb to figure it out and I don't want to break it. And somehow that man's mind works. Like he'll actually look at something and think, Oh, here's the mechanism that fixes it. Um, he hates it when I give him a voice because clearly that's not what his voice sounds like. Um, in fact, that was the voice he usually gives me. He gives me a voice that sounds like, did you watch Downton Abbey? Um, Maggie Smith's character in there. Um, yeah, when he talks in my voice, that's the voice he gives me and I don't like it. So I think that's what I was doing. I was giving it back to him. Um, hey, Craig, will you try to open this for me? She says you just pull it. 
Okay, thanks. <laughs> this is a cute hair scrunchie. It's blue velvet with a cute little butterfly bow. Um, this is, what is this? She says, I made this keychain and bracelet with some inspirational messages on it to remind everyone how special they are. I know that you mentioned you don't wear bracelets often, so if you want to pass it along to one of your daughters, that would be fine too. Um, life is a journey, not a destination. I, um, I totally believe that's true. Um, it also says she believes she could, so she did. I love that one. Live your dream. Never, never give up. I love, I love all these. Um, I'm sure that my crappy phone camera won't focus on them, but I love it. Amber, you're so cute um, and sweet and nice and kind and generous and um, that's so cute. Okay, and here is um, a bracelet and um, it has similar sayings and it also has this cute little tree on there. That again, it won't focus. I guess I should insert a picture. I should have said that already. Um, so cute. Um, this is off subject too, but I like little inspirational quotey things. Um, and sometimes like you'll see a meme or a little quote thing, you know, that is out there and I'll like just kind of screenshot the ones that I think are cute. And one time when I was looking back, cause then I, on my camera I, or on my phone, I put them in their own little file called like memes or quotes or something. And then um, I'll try to work on opening this, as I tell you. Um, I did think maybe it would be cute to do like a video where I just insert a bunch of those that I like because sometimes they, you know, oh, cute. It's a puzzle. Um, okay, so I will put together the puzzle and I'll insert the picture so that you can see what it is because um, I'm at like 22 minutes and I'm going to have to cut my video down so that you guys will watch it because otherwise you'll see a 22 minute video about me getting gifts and you'll think, nope, I'm not watching that one. Um, <laughs> and um, what did this pop out of? Because um, there's two magnets too. I don't even know where they came from. Um, live in the moment. Today is a new day. They are um, kind of blue and purple tie-dyed backgrounds, which I think are cute. And this was so incredibly sweet and generous. And I don't even know how to thank you, Amber. Um, I'm, I'm not, I kind of suck at, um, I don't know, saying thank you. I suck at so many things. Um, I really suck at giving gifts back. I don't think I'm very good at expressing my feelings in a way that comes across without me feeling like I'm being dumb or like I feel like it could come across not sincere when I am sincere. I don't know. Um, I don't know. It, um... I started a YouTube channel because I moved, you know, away from every, everyone I'd ever met and knew in life, except for my husband, um, to a town where we, you know, just didn't know anybody and then weren't supposed to leave the house. And I was going to keep my job and, you know, like drive the seven hours back, I had worked it out with my boss where like I could come back just, you know, once a month even and work for a week um, because I liked my job and they really liked me there. Um, and I had, you know, good clients that, you know, had, didn't want me to leave either. And Because of the pandemic and stuff, it wasn't comfortable for me. It felt like super weird to um, go back into the salon and um, 
because I gave people facials, I they needed their masks off, um, you know, for me to actually work on them, which then felt funky um, to be that close. You know, I'm, I'm this close to people and I'm touching them. And I even had gotten um, like an N95, 93, whatever those masks were that, you know, I would wear for those times or, um, and I had a, a shield even, and but it just, it felt like I wasn't doing the right thing to be going and doing that when I didn't need to be. And, but it also feels very isolating to then be somewhere new where you just don't know anybody and don't see anyone. And even when you had to go to the grocery store, you know, there's not a single soul that I could even like say hi to that was a friend because I didn't know a single person. Anyway, started watching YouTube and um, I started watching it because I had, you know, been getting fat, fit, fun, but um, when it came, that was fun um, to have mail for, you know, a day, but then it went away and I thought, well, I'll just get um, another subscription box. And then I am cheap enough that I didn't want to just not do any research into a subscription box. So I had to watch a bunch of subscription box unboxings, um, which then I was vicariously shopping through all of these people. So then I didn't even necessarily need this, all the subscription boxes because I was just like going to watch theirs. Um, and that was fun for me. And then I watched enough that I noticed people, you know, kind of the same people making comments. Cause I think the comment sections are fun to, you know, read. And sometimes I would want to make a comment, um, but I didn't, you know, make comments at all at first, um, for many, many months. And then when I started kind of wanting to make comments, my, you know, name was still my name, just, you know, in the thing. And it was a big gray K. Um, and I didn't feel like anybody, you know, was talking back or answering back. And then I felt like I probably sound creepy or something, you know, they don't know me. Why would they? But I could tell that they were answering other people back and talking to them. So that's when I decided I should just make like a video or two. And then when I make a comment, they could click on my little K and they could watch, you know, a video of me and know I wasn't like some kind of serial killer ish type stalker person like I'm relatively normal and if I just had put up a video or two and then maybe they would chat back um and that's what I thought I would do just so I had people to talk to and then I thought that was actually fun I liked doing it and I honestly was shocked when I got a few subscribers like even when I had 10 subscribers, I kind of, I'm like, that seems strange. Why would these people subscribe to me? Because, and yeah, I'm long winded. I'm so sorry. Um, all I wanted to get to was that it seems so great that, um, these people that I don't know, <laughs> um, people like Amber would send me or want to send me a present in the mail that I cross their mind um, that, I don't know, it feels very special and I really appreciate it. And we're going to see how much of that I can edit out. <laughs> um, okay, we're going to stop now. And um, thank you for watching my videos. Um, comment if you like. And um, Check out Amber's channel if you um, haven't. She does wonderful, <laughs> wonderful tutorials. Lord, okay, I gotta whew, um, edit more of this out. <clears throat> I don't know if it's gonna get any better. I keep, every time I keep saying it, I just start crying again. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna eventually be out of space to tape. Um, so, Hopefully most of that will be edited out. And um, all I want to actually say, see, here, here's a thing too. Um, sometimes I realize as I'm talking, 
nobody cares. <laughs> like stop giving them all that background information. Just get to the point. Um, so the point is, um, thank you, Amber. I appreciate it. And everyone watching should go check out Amber's channel because she's a very special person and, and I'm not going to make it through again if I keep going. Okay. Um, thanks for watching. <laughs> Don't make fun of me. Okay. Bye.